and Brad, the two most famous physical therapists on the internet. Check, check. Hi, folks. I'm Bob Schrupp, physical therapist. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. And we are the most famous physical therapists on the internet. In our opinion, of course. I'm going to take myself down a few levels here. I'm a little <laughs> up. Okay, today we're going to talk about fixed hunchback posture with a sock. And, and it only takes five minutes a day. So It's a wonderful, Bob's invention, too. It really, <laughs> we were just discussing I invented that. the sock. By the way, if you're new to our channel, please take a second to subscribe to us. We provide videos mm. how to stay healthy. Fit, pain-free, and we upload every day. Also, you want to join us on our social media channels, especially we're going to go to the giveaway section at Bob and Brad. We're always giving something away, giving away a beauty this week. We're oh, giving yes. away the Thermatex Infrared Heating Pad. This thing is fantastic. This gives you deep heat. Regular heating pad goes just a mm, few millimeters. Skin deep. This goes 10 times more, 10 times more deeper. Yep, so. 2.36 inches yep. according to studies. It's a uh, wonderful device. Yep, you can find it on Facebook too. It'll be pinned to the top of the page. Go to Twitter or Instagram if you want a short version of our program. There you go. All right, Hunchpack. We're talking about, you know, when people start to get that little almost nodule or knob you know, at the top, uh, right at the base of their neck. And what happens is it just simply... Yeah, from poor posture over time, that bump starts to, you know, the spinous process starts to get a little more prominent. Sure. And it sticks right. out further right. and further. And, you know, some people call it that dowager's hump, which we get a lot of comments on what the dowager's hump yeah, really is. Yeah, I think is. dowager's hump is down here, and there's one hump up here. There's there's a lot of humps. So, <laughs> anyway. Or, or another, this is going to help all of them. It is. I mean, to correct this, all we're going to do is we're going to prov uh, provide a counter force mm -hmm. the other direction, give it a stretch. These these bones are held together by tough ligaments. Right. Once they get tightened down, it's difficult to stretch them out just, you know, manually like this. You need a counter force. Right. So we got a sock here. We're going to have you lay on it. It's going to give you that counter force. And hopefully over time, I'm not going to, this isn't going to happen in one week even. Right. Hopefully right. over a period of a, a month or two, you'll start to notice that, you know, your posture is improving and the hump is starting to disappear. Right. right. So again, the sock, actually there's more than one sock there, Bob. Better there's get into actually three socks. Three pair or three socks? Three pair. Three. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it apart at the end. Oh, okay. So you can see, because I got this all shaped real nice, bro. Yeah, it is. So what's nice about this, you know, a lot of people try to use a tennis ball, and we've even recommended a, like a towel over a tennis ball. Sure. This, you can you can make it any size you want. You can make it any firmness you want. Some of you are not going to be able to tolerate much. Right. You know, it, you know, Brad and I can a fair amount because we have decent posture, wouldn't you say? And and we work with these. I right. mean, with other ones. You know, we've worked with the tennis ball. We've right. got the back pod, which is another story. But this is definitely going to be more comfortable for a lot of people. Right. So what you're going to do is just, you know, I want you to do a couple times a day if you can. Right. And this is an easy thing to do. So, Brad, why don't you – oh, you're going to do it to me. Yeah. You're going to yeah. show me where you're going to place right. it. Right. So you're going to actually do this laying on a carpeted floor. You could use a hard floor if you wanted to. But first you're going to put it right in the center, right there at the base of the neck, upper part of the back, and you're going to lay there. And then – and we'll show you on the yeah. floor. And, and then we're going to go off to the side between the spine and the scapula or the shoulder blade on this side. And we can do it on this side. And it's going to depend on, on your back individually and how you feel it should be there. But you can go up a little higher, a little lower. Right. You know, you just really need to lie, lie down for like 30 seconds on each section. You know, it doesn't take that long. Is it lie or lay? You lie down. That's right. Yeah. I was just testing them. <laughs> I'm glad okay. you did. Why don't you go ahead? So you can, um, I've listed, you can go four spots if you want. And each spot, 30 seconds. That just takes a couple minutes. You do it twice a day. You know, for less than five minutes a day, you can start uh, correcting your posture. And let me tell you, with most people, this is, if you want to work on one area to correct posture, that's it. That's, you know, if you correct that, Brad, mm -hmm. everything else starts to straighten out. Sure. So yep. it's, uh, it's a big one. Why don't you go ahead and lay down, I, Brad? Okay. So I've got the sock this way. Uh, you could put it this way, I suppose. Sure. You can you, experiment it's, around. Yeah, it's going to depend on how it feels. Like right now, I can tell I, I need to move it down a little bit. It's too high. It's up in my neck a little bit. 
All right, and the sir, you want to then give me that towel roll, Bob? Sure. You may need this for your head. Yep, a pillow or a towel roll, uh, so you can rest your head and relax. You don't tighten up your neck muscles. And there we go. See now, look what he's doing when he's in this position. He's bringing his arms out, so he's getting a little more of a stretch, and he's stopping those arms from internally rotating. Now they're externally rotating. And while he's in this position, he's going to take some nice deep breaths. You know, that's going to help work the spine too and work the rib cage. And uh, he can also do some chin tucks while he's in this position. Sure. So, so I'm gonna move. And actually, if you're going to do chin tucks, a towel roll is a little better than a, t a pillow, a right. firm pillow. So you see, again, he's, he's tucking his chin in, and that's a great thing to do along mm. with this. So really easy stretch to do. You know, this is something that anybody can do. And you can go ahead and adjust it. So now he's going to hit a different spot. That one going up or down a little bit on the left between the shoulder blade and the back. You know, this, uh, you're going to have to make sure you have a, the, the sock roll is pretty firm for a lot of people because if it's too soft, you'll smush into it. But Bob, you're going to talk about that at the end of the video. Right, right. But I, I mean, it, where is this lot with you right now, Brad? Is this too firm for no, you? No, it's just about right. Yeah, but, I thought so. It was about right for me. But we're, again, I don't think we're typical, Brad. I think because we worked with it so well, much. Of course we're not typical. We got, <laughs> we got issues, Bob. <laughs> so there our cameraman, Mike, has to laugh about that. But uh, all right, Brad, I want to show also, do you mind? Um, oh, yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show that I actually, this is an ongoing joke with my family and even Brad. I use it in my car also. I use a, st a sock like this. Because I'm tall, when I'm driving, it's really easy for me to go like this. Well, that car you had 15 years ago, what was it? A little Toyota Corolla or yeah. something like that? <laughs> yeah. That actually had a deep seat. That, I, I know, but it yeah. still is amazing yeah. that you so sit the, in there. You mean the Subaru. The, yeah, the, yeah Subaru. the Subaru. You can just imagine. Yeah. So um, I actually keep a towel. Now, this isn't going to work here because I'm, I am i don't have anything to lean up against. Oh, But yeah, I, I put it. I, I lean right up against the sock right here. Yeah. And I can do chin tucks while I'm in the car. It's just, it's almost like a treatment every day when I, yep. when I, and it really works on my posture. It's to the point now where I can't be in the car without something. Like I'll be in somebody else's car and I'll pull my gloves out or right. a uh, pop can or. Yeah, I so. remember the first time I saw you do that. <laughs> He's sticking something back there. Yeah, I, I don't know if it was your towel roll or you just smushed up some gloves, but I remember that. Yeah, distinctly. yeah. So anyway, so I just took two two socks here, Brad, and oh, I rolled them up like that. Oh, yeah. You must do laundry a lot. Eh? You did a nice job. Yeah, these are clean. There's another one. Yeah, different people so, roll their socks differently, so. So I just put them, I put ball them, style. Yeah, I put them two together like that. Yeah. I put them together like that. Then I just took a sock like this and went over the top like this. Oh. And then I opened up one and, you know, went over both of them like this. So that that one sock is going to get a little stretch. Yeah, and that then I once I got it on, I just shaped it. Yeah, so, yeah, you customize you'll, it. You'll figure it out. But, yeah, um, if you haven't done any socks before, you might have to ask right. someone. So get your socks. Look at that! <laughs> I hit the camera. Wow. I wonder if you could slow down, slow the motion that. So, all right, we can fix just about anything except for a broken heart. There you go. But we're working on it.